Hey world, this is Lovable1234321. Today's topic is the Master Cleanse. So, today is day 10 of the Master Cleanse. That's right, day 10. Not only am I excited that I have completed this journey, I'm thrilled. I'm so happy because all this time I believed in myself. I stayed determined, even though it was hard, I had great willpower, and then I had other people motivating me as well. Those things are so important if you do decide to do the master class. Day 10 went like this. So I woke up this morning, pumped, mostly because, well, first because I woke up, thank you, Father. Second thing, day 10 is here. <laughs> Eating food is around the corner. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay? When I tell you guys I was excited about this day, I'm just like, oh, the Master Plans have showed me so many different things about myself that I may have not known if I hadn't taken this journey, but... I'm just happy that I found it, I found it within myself, discipline, because this is straight discipline, to not eat food for 10 days, it's not too many people that's not, there's not too many people that's going to go without food for 10 days, believe me, I've been telling people about this master cleanse and telling them about the great results and they're like, uh, 10 days, I don't know, I may do three or four days, which I can understand, but if you discipline yourself and you motivate yourself and you're your only cheerleader on your team, you can do it. You can do it. Look at me. I'm a prime example, guys. Okay, when I started this journey, let me start off with my weight. When I started this journey, oh, was it on the 5th? Oh, guys, I'm not sure about the exact date, but it was the Monday before last, and today is Wednesday. When I started this journey, guys, my weight was a total of 235 pounds. That's right. I said it. You heard it from my mouth. Me. 235 pounds. When I ended this journey, hey, let's even talk about day nine. On day nine, I got on that scale that morning. I was 215 pounds. Day 10, I'm 215 pounds. 20 pounds in 10 days. 20 pounds in 10 days. Yes, I'm a prime example of what you can do if you just make yourself do it. It was not easy. I would be a big old laugh. I came to you and said, oh, that's clean. It's, you know, it's pretty cool. You know, you go without food. You drink your little lemonade and... You know, you all good. That's a story. That is a story. It's a story. Okay? You may feel pumped up and you may feel good during the first couple of days and stuff, but it's like your mind is triggered. Like, oh, food. Well, I don't know about your mind, but my mind was triggered. Like, man, I'm sure I am hungry. Man, you got to go through that drive through Man, that food smells good. Can I get some? It's just like that. It's like food is on the brain. I guess when you go without something and you're having it day to day and uh, you miss it, of course, which is only natural. But food was mainly on my mind. A couple of tips to tell you guys when you're on this master plan. Something that I picked up. When I got really, really hungry. And I was, it was some days I was tired of the lemonade. I'm looking like, I don't want no more lemonade. I don't want no more cayenne pepper. I do not want any more maple syrup. Because it's like, ugh. Lemonade is like, ugh to me now. Really, it is. I'm just like, ugh. Go to sleep. Take you a nap if you can. Get away from the food. When you really go without food, you start to realize it seems like everything is shaped around food. And you may be laughing at me when I say this, but 
everything is shaped around food. You watch TV, the commercials, oh my goodness, Magnum ice cream, the, 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 the chocolate and the vanilla and the caramel ice cream on there, and Wendy's and Burger King, got everybody. It's like, you hungry, come get us. What, what is that about? What is that about? Man, come on now, you know I'm trying to do better. Temptation is all around you. You get out of the house. What do you see? Nothing but down the street is fast food restaurant. You look up, you see a billboard restaurant. Temptation is all around you. And then it may be some a-holes. Yeah, I call them a-holes. That's going to even try to tempt you while you're doing good to make you eat food. Just because they have to know good. But that's when your determination, your willpower comes in. Guys, you are stronger than you think. You really are. This this is some this is motivation. I, I will call this Master Clan's motivation day ten. Because this is how serious it is. If you're gonna do it, do it. Don't fail yourself. It's hard. It was hard. It was hard. Because I'm a woman that loves to eat. And that's the truth. I won't lie about it. When you look at me, you can see it in my face. You can see it in my body. I'm a woman that loves to eat. And I've been eating too much. That's why I did these master plans. Because I know I need to clean some toxins out of my system. I think the best way to do it is just keep it real. Keep it 100. Keep it 100 with everybody who's watching this video. And most mostly most important is to keep it real with yourself and if you can't keep it real with yourself then hey you can't keep it real with nobody but what i basically what i mainly wanted to say oh my head's on my head. what i basically wanted to say was um, i just wanted to talk to you guys about day 10. day 10 went smooth today of course i had the temptation again but I kept saying to myself, okay, Jennifer, you know, tomorrow you're going to have um, orange juice, chicken broth, and other things, mostly liquids. But I know that I have to have this in my mind, to have that, have that mind focused on what you need to do to better yourself, to better your health. And... I pray that God gives me strength throughout this journey because I'm going to need it because it doesn't end here on today. It doesn't end just because I ended the master plan. This is a lifelong journey, but I know what I want out of life. I know I want to be healthy. I know I want to stay fabulous, and I know I have to do it and have great health. I know that's the only way that I'll be able to do it. It's having great time. So, let's get back because I know I keep going a little bit off. Just because I'm so excited. I am so excited. Ah, let's take a deep breath. So, I was talking about day 10, guys, right? Okay. Um, Day 10, I went out today. I was so hungry. I was tired of drinking that lemonade mix because you know guys like I said I was tired of it um I did do my organic laxity and that went by great I didn't have any um bowel movement such as that oh another question everyone asks me while you're on the master cleanse do you Use the washroom. Does it make you use the washroom? Me? I can speak for others, but with me, no. It, it did not keep me going um, regularly to the washroom. I actually had um, better bowel movements when I was off of the cleanse, which was really, really different for me. I was like, okay, that's, that's pretty different. But, um, yeah. I'm trying to think of a couple of other questions that you guys would ask me. Um, the weight came off really well. Um, 
What I plan on doing now, starting tomorrow, is 50 crunches in the morning, 50 crunches at night, 30 minutes on the treadmill. Keep that up, keep that going. I really hope I don't gain one pound back. I don't want to gain one pound back. I just want to go down, down, down. And then what I want to do is get updates. Get updates from this master plan. Post master plan. So that would be pretty cool too. I really feel good about myself. I've always felt good about myself as to how I look and to how I feel. But when I say I feel better, ah, uh, I do. I feel refreshed. My mind is really clear on a lot of things and a lot of situations. I feel like this is a new beginning for me. I feel like lovable one, two, three, four, three, two, one is on her way to something bigger and better. And I don't even know what it is. But I know my faith teaches me just to stay disciplined and just know that this right here, this is not the end. Greater and greater things are to come. So with that being said, guys, I'm going to let you go. I know I got a little long-winded. It's just this hype energy. You you also have a, a lot of hype energy. Um, if you guys have any questions that you wanted to ask me while I was on this master plan or anything to help you guys out, please let me know. I'll do the best I can to answer all of you guys emails and um questions so i'll end it with this whoa 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 I'm a survivor, I didn't give up, I'm a survivor, I'm gonna work harder, I'm a survivor, I'm gonna make it, I'm a survivor, keep on surviving. Peace, y'all. Love you much. And thanks to all of my subscribers, my growing subs. You guys, I love you guys, each and every one of you all. Thank you for taking the time out of your day to subscribe to my videos and to hear what I have to say. That means all the world to me. It really does. Thank you. Thank you.